In this elementary tutorial video, I will show how to create a minimalistic contact us page in Elementor WordPress. If you follow this tutorial, you can easily make a great looking contact us page within a very short time, like 15 to 20 minutes. So without any further ado, let's get started making the contact us page. Okay, so in order to make the contact us page, start by adding a new page from the back end of the WordPress website. So we're going to go to the back end of the WordPress website, open up the dashboard. Okay. It's loading. Okay. Now go to pages and click on add new. Okay. Add new page. I will now write down the name of the page contact us. Okay. I will publish the page. Okay, great. Now I will edit with Elementor. Okay. Um, now what you need to do, we need to, after over here, where the contact us, you see this title over here. We don't need this. So what are you going to do? We're going to come to go click over here, page settings. Then we're going to scroll down and turn this on hide page title. Okay, great. So this is how it looks. Now I'm going to add a new Flexbox container over here. Great. Now I'll just uh, give it a minimum height. Such as 305 pixels. Okay. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to click over here. I'm going to visit pixabay.com and I'm going to just write down office. Okay, I'm going to search for a free stock image. Office, okay, over here. Um, maybe I can use a, a simple image like this one over here. Just to have a background, I will download this image. Okay, and go to style, background type. I'll click on the image. Okay, I'll drag and drop this image over here. Select. Okay, great. It is selected. Now I'm going to do go to background overlay and give this overlay a dark color 000 and uh, turn this like this one over here. And I'm going to come over here. <coughs> okay, I'm going to come over here background and um, attachment fixed so that it scrolls like this okay you can see the image like this it's a parallax effect okay now what i'm going to do i'm going to add the page title over here heading i'm going to center align it center and also align it center vertically and i'm going to make this html h1 heading okay i'll give it a name contact us okay and maybe i can make this color of this uh, title to be white great so this is how it looks right now and then i'm going to add a new section over here and add a flexbox container i'm going to add this two uh shape like this two column layout over here and i'm going to add a title over here Okay, and I'm going to uh, change it. Like I'm going to write down contact us today. Okay, and then over here below that, I'm going to add some text, maybe some explanatory text over here, and then I'm going to add a list of icons. Okay, list list i'm going to add a new list uh, icon list over here and over here firstly i'm going to write down support at the rate of uh, handyman.com and i'm going to change the icon to be envelope envelope okay now 
then I'm going to change this to be phone. Okay. 888-8888-8888. Okay. Then I'm going to change uh, to be address maybe uh, something like this uh, new. Maybe I can say Brooklyn New York USA. Okay. And I'm going to change the icon to be something like the map icon. I'll just the map. This one. Okay, great. And maybe I can use a, a different color for the icon. Okay, over here. I'm I can use the sentiment blue. Over here, list. I'm going to put the space between the list like this. Okay. Okay, it looks good. And below this, all of this, I can add uh, social icons. Social icons over here. Great. I can make some changes to them. Center left align. Okay. Uh, what do you need? Uh, round it. Uh, I can make it circle. And I can change the color, official color to instead of, okay, I can make it custom color. And over here, I can change the secondary uh, primary color to be handyman blue. I can decrease the size. Okay. And I can increase the spacing between each of one of this. Okay, great. Uh, next, what I'm going to do, I'm going to add um, contact form, the form element, okay, by Elementor. You can also use other uh, form element alternatives such as you can use uh, WP forms to add this contact form. Okay, and also if your uh, contact form is not working and not sending out emails, then you can follow another one of my video uh, in which how to which I show how to solve this issue. Okay, uh, to make the contact form uh, send the details uh, to you easily within minutes. Okay. Okay, now over here, this is the form element. Now I'm going to go to button and I want this to be style button. I want this to be like this left. Okay. And maybe I can, let me just select it again. I can hide this uh, label and make this uh, label size medium or large. Okay large html fill color to be light gray the level fill color i want this to be light gray okay you see it like looks like and maybe i can remove this border so that it looks a bit maybe i can keep the border but uh, decrease the opacity so that it's light like this one we see that now it looks better and over here field maybe i can increase the row gap okay like this one over here great now uh, let's just add a bit of advanced padding let's add 80 pixels to the top and 80 pixels bottom okay so this is how it looks so we are almost done over here and the next the last part is, uh, but we can also increase the spacing between this layout. The gap, uh, column gap, I can increase to 20. Okay, great. So it looks better. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to add another Flexbox container, like this one over here, and add a map element over here, map, Google Maps, okay. So it's better if you show your location properly. Okay, and another thing I want this map to be full width stretching out on either side. So I'm going to click on this container. Okay, I'm going to content width instead of box, I want it to be full width. 
and also I want this no padding so that it covers up entire. Okay, I now I'll choose the map element and increase the height. Okay, so that it looks nice and big. Okay, okay, and so as you can see over here, we're done with making the contact us page. You see that this is the contact us header. This is the main uh, details of contact us today. Some text you want to explain, direct them to contact over here. Social icons, contact form, and the map bot at the bottom. Okay. Uh, the last thing to do is check for the mobile and tablet responsiveness. I'm going to click on the tablet version. On tablet, you see that it looks fine. Okay. Also on mobile, let's check. On mobile, you can also see that on mobile, it also looks fine, okay? Great, it also looks fine. I'll publish these changes, great. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to add this contact us page in this menu over here, okay? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the dashboard of the page. I'm going to appearance menu, not widget, sorry. I'm going to appearance and then go to menus. And what I'm going to do pages, you see contact us page recently added, add to menu. It is added to the menu, okay. I'll save these changes. Now I'll refresh the page. And you see contact us page appears over here. If I click on this, You see that it takes us to the nice looking minimalistic contact us page. Let's scroll down. You can see that there's a parallax effect over here and contact us detail and then map. Okay. So this is how you make a contact page using Elementor. And I hope you have that you found this video useful. And if you did, then please make sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.